Hey, TC, I'll see that one. Uh, we got Kuz in the walk-off. Appreciate it. All right. Appreciate you, Mike. Let's do Dave then. Kuz, you addressed this with uh, Mike in that, that walk-off, but uh, you guys go 17 for 33 from three tonight. Been a couple months of struggling from the outside. What was the difference maker today, and what can you do moving forward to continue that success from the outside? I think we just got to continue to have the confidence and continue to play the right way. I think um, – <clears throat> this is probably our best game. <clears throat> our best game, um, you know, with all those guys out uh, of the season from a standpoint of playing the right way and uh, doing it for 48 minutes. I think from <clears throat> from the jump, we did a great job making the extra pass. Obviously, uh, defensively, hold, holding the team under 100 is, you know, what you want to do every time out. But um, even, you know, going into that second half, uh, trusting the pass, trusting the teammate. And we made shots. So I think uh, those are the factors. <clears throat> Dan Wakey. Hey, Coos. I think I know the answer to this anyways, but um, you talk about staying confident. You know, you had, I think, we're three for 15, two games ago, one for nine. Uh, the last game, did your confidence ever waver? Um, and, and how do you keep your confidence high when the ball's not falling? Uh, I mean, I <clears> – sorry. I mean, I put in a lot of work in this game. You know, I love this game. I love being in the gym. And, um, you know, it's going to come back around. It's going to come back around. So, um, you know, I had three rough games shooting the ball, but, you know, I like my shots, um, you know, just just had to get the mechanics right and, you know, just, you know, just keep letting it fly. Take good ones, and uh, they fell tonight. Kyle <clears throat> Goon? Hey, Kuz, I just want to ask something similar, but from a team perspective, I mean – when Andre gets injured, I'm sure that that felt just like, man, like, what do we got to do? Or like, what, like, why are the injury gods looking at us? Um, that could have gone left and that could have been a huge discouragement. Why do you think that wasn't? Uh, I mean, it was a toenail. <laughs> I don't think it was that serious. So, uh, I mean, you know, it was a toenail. So, you know, we weren't really scared. <laughs> You uh, you've, you've taken a lot of pride in your defense, and you spent some time on Buddy Hill tonight. Is that just yeah. your evolution? Because after all, he is a guard, I guess, playing the wing tonight. But are you pretty proud of the way you guys handled him tonight? Uh, yeah, you know, I take pride in, uh, you know, on the defensive end, uh, you know, going back to last season, and just it's all about it's all about growth. Um, I think over the past four years, I've done a great job of just trusting the process and, um, you know, just listening to coaches and, and, and applying, it. you know, I think now I've done a great job of, you know, I'm slowly becoming an all around player, you know, being able to play make, being able to score still, uh, play defense, rebound and, and lead. So, um, you know, that's, that's just my focus. And, you know, uh, that's why I want to be here so I can continue to learn and learn from the great players ahead of me. And, um, you know, uh, I just love his game. So, yeah. Cuz was there a moment defensively where it, it really felt like it clicked for you or where you found, like, this is the thing that I can be really good at, maybe an on-ball challenge or something that, that a coach along the way gave you? Um, I don't know. I don't know. You know, I, I just – I just kind of just told myself I got to stop being a B word. You know, I think that's the biggest thing, um, you know, just taking that challenge. Sorry, Ali. Um, you know, just taking that challenge and, you know, just trying to become an all around dog. And, um, you know, simple as that, you know, I'm getting more and more confidence uh, guarding those point guard, shoot guards, um, being versatile. Like you said, guarding a buddy that's uh, running off screens, you know, guarding a four. You know, guarding the wing, you know, it don't matter to me. You know, I'm just trying to, you know, continue to get better and win games. And, you know, it, it's helping me on the court. And one more here. Let's go to Corey Harrison. Hey, cool. It's Corey from the Out of Bounds Sports Podcast. You looked amazing tonight, hitting 6% of your shots from the field, finishing with the season high 30 points. What were you seeing out there tonight to make it look so easy? Uh, I was just letting the game come to me. I wasn't forcing anything, you know. You know you know, wasn't really trying to, you know, overdo it from an offensive standpoint of scoring and just letting the game come, um, you know, 
try driving in the paint, trying to get a teammate open. You know, that was really my focus all night. And, you know, when it was there, you know, I passed it. And when it wasn't, I found myself kind of open and I just took advantage of it. And, you know, the game is just slowing down for me. And, um, you know, just credit that to a lot of film and, you know, just a lot of patience out there and, you know, a lot of watching, a lot of watching. So. All right. Thank you for your time, Coos. Yep.